Well, Sports Live Summer Camp continues with the Broadmoor Bucks. Last year, the Bucks only got one win, but it was a big one because it snapped a near 20 game losing streak. Head coach Yassine Sarah believes things are moving in the right direction on Goodwood Boulevard. Though they have a young team, Sarah believes that immaturity is beginning to leave the building. Broadmoor won't have many upperclassmen suiting up in the fall. Matter of fact, they won't have to honor one player on senior night. But the Bucks do have an upperclassman in Kenneth Hawkins. The junior moved to quarterback, and he is more than up for the challenge. Yeah, it's more of a challenge because I actually have to think about, you know, the, all the routes and all the defensive plays. You know, usually last year when I played quarterback, it wasn't really, I was just on and off the field about it. He's been doing a really good job of picking up on the defenses, picking up on what we're looking for. Um, he still has a long way to go when it comes to technique, and it also comes to where we need him to be uh, pre-snap, post-snap. But we feel like he is coming a long way. He's our best athlete, one of our best athletes on the team. So we're going to try to get him the ball in his hands every time. That's all that matters. We are nine teams down in our 2023 Sports Line Summer Camp previews. If you miss any of the schools on this list or want to watch them again, Watch them again. They're all uploaded on WAFB.com. Look at your sports. We're back after this.